Avoid these defense mistakes in FC24 if you want to stop conceding easy goals, let's look at some common defense mistakes and the basic solutions, so without wasting much time let's jump into the video. Are you tired of matching up against overpowered squads? Visit u7buy.com for cheap and safe FC coins on the market. Remember to use the discount code DRFC for 6% off. Check the link in the description. One of the common mistake average players make is delay in player switches. If you don't eliminate this mistake you won't improve your defense. So take a look at this example. I throw the ball to my winger. I control it and face the opponent's side. I pass the ball to my striker Rushford. The ball moved a little bit slow and by this time the opponent should have already switched to the center back, but he delayed and I immediately decide to take my first touch forward, and that's when he switched to that defender, but he was too late, I get in behind the opponent's defense. Still another mistake but we shall talk about that later. Switching defenders quick enough improves your anticipation and reaction time, either by using the L1 switch or the analog switch, gives you an advantage over your opponent. For example here, I managed to block the opponent's way on the byline, so he turns and dribble to this direction, now here I have to select this defender because he's responsible of defending this area now, if I wait the defender will run like this and open these passing lanes, so I select him quick enough, apply pressure and win the ball back. Last example, here the opponent has this passing lane to his winger, I'm also controlling this player trying to block this passing lane, but he's too far to do it and the opponent is likely to pass. I know the opponent can pass to this player and if so I can use the L1 switch and select this defender, but I'm aggressive defender, so I quickly use the right stick switch, select my fullback and intercept that pass. We only delay in player switches only when defending one-on-one -on -one against the opponent's player, because we have to control that defender and stop the opponent from progressing forward. You can also delay in player switches when dragging a defender back to his position, or even tracking the opponent's running players. Another common mistake is over committing, unless you're aggressive defender and you know what it means to approach aggressively. If you don't then you have to should defend basically, this mistake is most common when defending one on one. Over committing you make it easy for the opponent to perform skill moves and beat your defender easily. Not only that but even those simple tricks like pass and move against your defenders. So to fix this first of all you have to keep 2 to 3 yards away from that player. Because in order for the opponent to beat your defender with any trick like skill move, he has to pass to your defender and leave him behind. But if you create that little space, here you're giving the opponent hard time. Then too, block the opponent's way towards your goal, you have to block that path, you just imagine it and see how the opponent can dribble towards your goal, then position your defender in that path. Lastly is to use the jockey system, the L2 and R2 for speed jockey, and L2 for slow jockey, here the defender moves very reactive and it's easy to change directions. Another mistake is to spam tackles, some players press the tackle button in a position where the defender cannot tackle the ball, and that defender performs the tackling animation, making easy for the opponent to move freely and create something. So to defend well you should eliminate this mistake, you only tackle if you know you're close to the opponent's ball holder. To basically tackle you consider, 1, the ball contact, when the opponent makes that heavy touch, then you're free to try and tackle away that ball. 2. When the opponent is dribbling recklessly facing your defender, here the ball is open and that's the opportunity to use and tackle the ball. The most common mistake average players make is to drag defenders out of positions, weakening the defense shape. Here it's hard to defend without open spaces in your defense. To defend with a solid defense team you should keep every defender in his position, here you're not opening spaces for the opponent's players to exploit, so to every area of the pitch the ball goes to, you have to select the defender responsible to defend, we have a dedicated video explaining this concept, check the link in the description. To DRB. Opportunity to deliver the cross. And Bellingham. Oh, good looking run. Looking for the angle. Well, he read that. Some players don't know what to do when the opponent enter their box. They defend blindly and give the opponent the opportunity to shoot with the open angle and score. So to defend inside the box you imagine a line from the opponent's player and your goalkeeper, 
then position your defender on that line, here if the opponent attempts to shoot, your player will block that shot. So you block the shot and at the same time also blocking the opponent's way towards your goal, just be patient and don't rush to tackle the ball. So that's it guys for today, hope we learned something, thanks for watching.